hey guys welcome back to my vlog uh, let me just say it has been so hot these days i don't know if you guys have been feeling the same way but um it is insane the level of heat it is just you know i it's like driving me kind of crazy in a way um it's not even just the regular temperature it's also the level of humidity it's just so hot so hot i actually just wet my hair because it's just like i just needed to cool off a little bit because it's so hot so sorry if my hair is <laughs> dripping a little bit um um i wanted to kind of give you an update of where i am right now of what i'm what i've been doing so I, I mentioned before that i have started um tutoring english i've been doing it for a few months now esl to mainly japanese students and that has been going really really well actually um not only am i enjoying the actual tutoring but i'm actually also enjoying speaking with the students and learning more and more about japan um one of my students was telling me that you know they use both the western calendar and like when he said the moon calendar which i guess the lunar calendar um so that's why their new year starts um end of january beginning of february and um he said when the moon is the brightest that's the middle of the month that's the 15th of the month so that's how they um you know work with the calendar um so that was interesting and then now i've also started um doing uh math for csec tutoring as well so i have two classes right now with about uh three to four students each um i'm getting more students slowly as they trickle in um so i've been enjoying that and you know um i had a like a, one recently i was teaching a class and i forget what topic it was but we were doing some word problems right and i guess they were all just stuck they didn't know where to go with the word problem and i was like I was trying to tell them so listen you know you have this information they've given you this information they're not gonna give you you cannot use what you do not have they give you this information for a reason so figure out a way to use the information that you have and you know as i think about that i think about myself and using the skills that i have i cannot use what i don't have i mean i could develop skills that i don't necessarily have that doesn't necessarily come as easily but why um not utilize the skills that i know that i have and you know um when you look at things that are trending you want to be trendy and you want to um go into fields that everybody's rushing into but that mightn't be the best avenue for you the best thing for you might be to focus on what you could do using the skills that you do have and make that work for you and then maybe afterwards branch off and try to develop new skills um you know it's not always the, the sexiest industry is the best one for you to go into or the best trend or fashion statement or whatever for you to follow sometimes you just have to find your own path you have skills you have you were blessed with skills figure out a way to utilize those skills and make it work for you and i've really been learning to do that um i've also been contacted by somebody i used to do a little bit of freelance work for for a new project that's starting um a lot of things had kind of slowed down because of the whole covid thing and investors were running scared not you know knowing where to if they wanted to continue to invest in certain projects but now as i mean COVID's still here but i guess people have become um they have you know they have kind of settled into the way of life right now so they are going about investing and doing different things so i'm gonna start a new projects soon and there are a couple other things that i've been working on of course i'm still doing my um my weekend stuff and um so i've been getting really busy and you know what busy is good it's better to be busy <laughs> than not have anything going on so um i'm really grateful for that i'm not and i had mentioned in a video some time ago that you know it's important to not um miss out on opportunities that are brought forth towards you so i am um, you know taking my own advice on that when a new opportunity comes i am saying yes i'm saying yes before i say no that was also another video say yes before you say no and then eventually you might be able to start saying no when you have gotten to the point where you need to be and um I've, I've kind of adopted that mantra now so i'm making sure that i am utilizing all the opportunities that i have i'm utilizing the skills that i have i'm not trying to you know fight down some skills that i don't have of course eventually i can develop new skills but i'm really going to take advantage of what i have what i'm blessed with and what I, I'm sure that I can do to the best of my ability. So I just wanted to leave that little tidbit with you guys. I hope you guys are staying safe, 
staying cool hopefully <laughs> uh, you know go and douse your head with on some water like i did or whatever it is that you need to stay cool stay hydrated and i'll see you guys again soon bye